$53 of that is, is driven by exports. We're disappointed. Exports are critical to the livelihood of U.S. pork producers. We export more than 26% of U.S. production to foreign markets. Uh, China is a particularly important market. Last year we sent $1.1 billion of pork to China. That made it the second largest export market by volume. So it's a, it's a disappointment. Um, hopefully the United States and China can resolve these trade disputes and we can return to more favorable access to what is a very important export market for us. We have a trade deficit, depending on the way you calculate, of $504 billion. Now, some people would say it's really $375 billion. Many different ways of looking at it, but any way you look at it, it is the largest deficit of any country in the history of our world. It's out of control. I think the uncertainty around trade in general is our biggest concern. Uh, it tends, that, that type of uncertainty that we're seeing right now tends to stall investment. Um, our pork producers um, are in expansion mode right now. We have never seen greater demand for U.S. pork. We're the most competitive pork producing nation in the world. We produce the highest quality, the most affordable, the safest pork in the world. Uh, it's in great demand around the world, but right now because of uh, uh, uncertainty around the situation with China, with other export markets, like you know, the situation with NAFTA and Mexico and Canada. It has pork producers and others in agriculture nervous about investments to take advantage of what is great demand for our product right now. It's also critical for the U.S. economy. There are 550,000 jobs in rural America that are tied to the U.S. pork industry. 110,000 of those jobs are tied directly to exports of U.S. pork. So. Trade and, and exports are really important, um, not only for our industry, but for the U.S. economy.